In this paper, I introduce a semiotic translation of the key term built in both the Tractatus Logico Philosophicus and the Philosophical Investigations. I argue that this term, usually translated as picture, points to a systemic polysemy that can be addressed in a more comprehensive manner using the conceptual tools provided by semiotics. In this sense, I introduce a type of translation whereby any iteration of build is characterized as reflecting the author's intentions at a given moment. In order to accomplish this task, I first analyzed the semiotic substratum of Wittgenstein's philosophy in both the Tractatus and the Investigations. The analysis is divided into three thematic units. 1. Wittgenstein's definition of sign in both the Tractatus and the Investigations. 2. Conceptualization of the semiotic translational approach to be applied on the basis of the Wittgensteinian concept of proof following. 3. Translation of the term build as mapping picture image, representation, idea, and factual picture. In order to understand how the term built is used in the works of Wittgenstein, it is first necessary to take a closer look at the conceptualization of sign in both the Tractatus and the Philosophical Investigations. Although I don't endorse the artificial divide between an early and a late Wittgenstein, we'll make the distinction for clarity purposes. Thus, for the early Wittgenstein, the idea of sign was binomial, and rested on the definition of symbol as a framework for signification. Es kann nie das gemeinsam mit Merkmal zwei Gegenstände anzeigen, das wird sie mit dem Seelenzeichen, aber durch zwei verschiedene Bezeichnungsweisen bezeichnen. Denn der Zeichen ist ja willkürlich. Man könnte also auch zwei verschiedene Zeichen wählen. Und wo bliebe dann das Gemeinsame in der Bezeichnung? On the other hand, for the Wittgenstein of the philosophical investigations, signs are a tripartite combination of sign meaning use. Jede Zeichen scheint allein tot. Es gibt im Leben, im Gebrauch lebt es. Ist der Daten Leben ein Atem in sich? Oder ist der Gebrauch sein Atem? As we can see in Table 1, the key term build has different translations associated with specific contexts in the remarks. We see, for example, that build has two main translations, namely factual and mapping picture. Mapping pictures are qualia, that is, propositions emerging at the interface of conceptualization in which objects exist at broad science in a mental space. Such qualia contain a potentiality for syntactic arrangements, and hence for speciality and action. This is best summarized in the picture theory. We make ourselves mapping pictures of facts in logical space. Mapping pictures provide a glimpse into reality by showing us how objects are arranged in a certain way. This is the structure of the mapping picture. That this map is possible constitutes its pictorial form. Mapping pictures correspond to objects only if they share a logical form with them. Ultimately, logical mapping pictures depict the world, that is, meaning arises from the syntactic application of science according to logical rules.